Looks like the uh, deck star is approaching completion. It's the size of a small moon. That's no moon. That's a deck star. Alright, that's quite enough of that. This level, somebody was saying they really like the music in this level. Don't know if I agree so much. It's really, this is one of those definitely really early 90s type of design things that hasn't really held up so hot, but whoa, no, I don't think so, Rolling Spring. Good lord. Are these guys, like, so tall that they just shoot right over my head? Okay, first of all, I want you. Oh, it fell down. That's weird. I was not expecting that. Yeah, they're just so tall. They just shoot right over my head. Okay. So am I supposed to follow this thing somewhere, this springy dingy? I feel like now that it's falling somewhere, I'm supposed to be following it, which is weird and... Hmm. Oh, hey, yeah, maybe I don't want to be jumping too much. These guys are pretty tall, after all. Yeah, I feel like I was supposed to... Well, now that it's... Hmm. Can I get it to respawn? Yeah, oh, hey, there we go. Now I want to follow it. Now I want to see what's going on here with it. Had to scratch my face. I don't want it getting quite out of view just yet. Okay, this... This is just going to turn into some kind of reward that's obviously not commensurate to the amount of effort I'm putting into it. I know that's what's going to happen. But why don't we just go ahead and let it follow us here. Yep, roll with me, roll with me. And I'm going to have to hold some kind of button too, aren't I? I'm going to get all this way and then not hold a button. And then it's going to punish me for not holding a direction. I'm going to hold right just in case i got to go down. So There we go. There we go. That was totally worth it. Now I'm going to go the other way and grab some carrots that I don't need. Unless I have to go that way now, and I just kind of screwed myself. Nope, there are two routes through here. It's just that it's just that letting the one-up thing pay off. Oh, crap. Now I've lost my fire shield. Now's the time when I start getting just completely destroyed here. Uh-oh. And these little neon things to my left here, these are actually spikes. They're like laser light spikes. So we got to be super careful. Nicely designed computer monitors, though. They're kind of a... Kind of a 3D improvement on Letney there. Oh, yes. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And I gotta find a way up to those carrots somehow. When you get invincibility, you want to blow through here as fast as you can. As you can maybe tell, I'm not the biggest fan of the Deck Star experience. Don't want to go to the right just yet. I think there may be things I'm missing. There's that carrot payoff. And I actually have 10 lives. I think that may be the first time I'm a, I've achieved double-digit lives in an episode. Uh, that would need confirmation, though. I'm not entirely 100% on that. Alright, so as long as I stay low, I should be fine. Okay, now I've hit a checkpoint, so i got to be really careful. If I decide to, uh... Okay. Oh, no. Really? Did I really get stuck here? Oh no, I could jump my way out with a little bit of finagling, that's cool. So yeah, you want to stay really low around these guys. Is there any kind of launcher that I can put into the floor to make this... There! Something happened. Something happened there, right? Or did the launcher just disappear entirely? No, I think that was the end of its run and it just disappeared. Okay, so I'm going to have to find some way into this. Okay. Oh, nope, there's no finding my way into those rapid fires. Now that's just cheap placement for that thing. Stay low, stay low, stay low to the ground. There's that wide energy bar again. Oh. Jeez, the hit detection is something else. This is probably not the gr Oh, good, carrots, that's good. Oh, hey, hello. Where are you going to take me? These have a weird kind of actually marble zone type of look to them. It's kind of like the marble zone if it went weird and dull and brown. Well, that was actually kind of a safe shoe run, and I kind of blew it there. Oh, well. Oopsie doodle. Hey, who can blame you, though? This is a really tough planet if you don't know what you're doing. Will I be rewarded with a dead end? Yeah. No carrots or anything. No fire shield or anything. No, don't worry about it, game. I'm fine. I don't, I don't need enemies that are exactly positioned to just blow me up with a big fat yellow laser that position themselves so they can shoot right at the floor. Good thing they're just shooting above my heads. Man, they're not very good marksmen. You can't say that for them. 
Um. Oh, <laughs> I was gonna be like launcher. Time to get out launchers. No, not even close. Uh, this is gonna get nasty. They're gonna do something mean to me at some point. I'm gonna end up losing a lot of my cool stuff, which I very much don't want to do. There is a really nasty boss here, and I do not want to lose to it. So I want to be really careful about how I tackle these guys as they just plot along. I want to be careful, and I want to watch them. Okay. Now we can get up there and probably... Boy, I can only imagine how hard this would be on, like, medium. Or hard, you know, which is designed to be hard. Okay, yeah, sure, I'll... Yeah, okay, I'm fine with that. As long as there's nothing over to the right here that I really super needed. Then, but I got 100% of the items anyway, so what am I complaining about? Alright, now I think it somehow probably gets even worse. Okay, yes. Well, as long as I... Hmm. As long as I uh, die before I get to the checkpoint, then I, I can live with that, I suppose. Is this a passage I can go over and completely ignore? Hmm. I have a feeling I'm going to have to be backtracking. To enjoy the fruits of that, so we'll go ahead and we'll run with it for now. Okay, yeah, you want to be careful going over the ledges here, over the pointy hills, because that puts you into a position where you can be shot by those guys. All right, okay, yeah, that basically deposits me at the beginning of the level. Okay, yeah, so there's actually eight rapid fires here if I feel so inclined. Okay, good. Okay. Alright, I really don't need to waste this. Come on now. Yeah, I essentially wasted that. Oh well. <laughs> I'm not too... I say I'm not too worried, but yeah, I'm a little worried that I kind of... Kind of blew that chance there with that. Um... Oh boy. Uh, oh, okay, there's my passage in. I just gotta make a blind jump, essentially. Okay. Okay, I want to be really careful, and I want to make sure I get him as he's coming back. Same for right here. Did I actually kill... Oh, wow, nice. I... Whoa, no, I don't want to repeat the same mistake twice, I don't think. Unless there's a spring... Some... No, that would definitely be backtracking twice, and we don't really... I mean, we have... Wow, that... See, this level is full of those cheap shots. That's exactly the kind of thing you want to avoid. You don't want to stand on these computers because you will get nailed if you're standing on them. And they're turned to face you and they're shooting that way. Okay. I'm just going to go ahead and jump over these things. This looks like an okay place to stand. Okay, they have a weird kind of... Okay, this might actually be worth it, though. To come in through this way and then backtrack? Okay. Okay, you need to actually jump into a place... Okay, I understand that you're just following me around, but you need to actually get in a place where I can get up there somehow. Okay, yeah. And then I drop down here. Oh, good. Okay, I didn't backtrack all the way. Okay, good. Woo! Oh, that's really good. That actually kind of makes my day right there. That was that was a nice little concession on the game's part. Now, so I guess the idea is to just jump on the edge of this thing? Okay, yeah. Is somehow that is somehow the idea. Okay. I like how they bob in such a way that you can actually hit them with your normal blaster if they're high enough cresting on their little schlumpy dumpy walk. Let's stay low. And then I think we're good to go. No. Okay, yeah, we're gonna wanna hit the edge again there. Okay, now. Now I cannot afford to fail. From here on out, I gotta be super mega duper careful. What's down here? This is just a hiding spot from what would surely be some kind of really nasty enemy if I were on some kind of higher difficulty. And now I'm mad for getting all those dumb carrots. Ah, oh, I missed a 1-up. I have 10, though. Why would I need 11? At this point, I'm just being greedy. And I feel like I missed something. Hmm. How do I get to that now? First, I should get rid of all the uh, enemies and not worry too much about that. Until I have... Okay, he's dead. How do I get across to this now? Oh, man. This is going to be... I had to hold all the way left when I was bouncing up there. Okay. Well, 
no bonus level unless I die, which is not worth it at all. Holy crap, no, I don't want to do that. Good God. Well, thank God for that, but no, it is so not worth having a shoe right here. Good God. Really horrible spike positioning. Oh my God, why would I agree to have a shoe right here? There is no way I can run this. Oh, the run is right here. Okay, I see, I get it. Whoa, okay, and two additional minutes. That's silly. Everything about Dexstar is silly. I know some people have just liking this world, or maybe the music, but I don't really like anything about it. Count me in as a Dexstar non-fan. This is... This level really like the design... Oh! Well, I think we can forgive the design if I get a fire shield. <laughs> that, then that's just alright with me. And a hip-hop. Wow, pretty much... If I'm able to find a carrot, I've pretty much got maximum hit protection here. Alright. Okay, good. Okay, that I'm down with. Alright, and launchers and seemingly no enemies in sight. That's cool. Okay, yeah, this is the kind of thing, yeah, if they were facing me, they would have totally been able to get me. Because of, of the way the pipes just curve up gently. Doesn't seem too bad. Doesn't Seems like pretty subtle level design, but even the subtlest hits... Yeah, sure. Take away my hip hop, even though I was charging at you full speed. Generally, when you get got with the fire shield, and you're, you'll lose your fire shield if you're just kind of if you're like charging at full speed toward your enemy. You'll lose the fire shield over the hip hop, but that didn't seem to be the case here, because of course my copy of the game is weirdly prejudiced against hip hop. Oh, hey, invisible passage that I wasn't actually intending to find. Well, it looks like we're going to be skipping bonus level fun. Okay, oh, no. I actually can't go through here or anything. Well, that's cool. Is there another such passage anywhere, maybe? Mayhaps? No, it's blocked by pipes. Alright, let's get on to the boss, then. 98%. Yeah, I'm sure that 2% was the thing I was looking for, the bonus gem. Oh, I can't believe I flubbed that. Well, I kind of can, because I have a poor memory of these episodes, but... Okay, now we want to get out our rapid-fire stuff. This guy right here, what are we doing? Oh, yeah, it's these little bat things. Okay, I have a fire shield, though, so... I'm not incredibly worried just yet. But I have tons of rapid-fires. Basically, we want to shoot this thing, I think. Okay, yeah, we want to hit this side of the reactor, then... Okay, quit sending out these little turtle things. Or whatever they are, these little little bat demon pieces of crap. Okay, yeah, now we want to shoot them. Alright. That was weird. But Devin makes his getaway, and that's a nicely animated little scene. Basically, you just want to have really good shieldage at that point. That's really all there is that. And shoot the part of the reactor that's flashing. That's what tripped me up the first time I did Dexter, and that's why I hate the boss one. Oh, speaking of decking, though. <laughs> wow. Deck the wall. Her hips are swinging weird, though. Is she pregnant there? I don't even want to think about that. Holy crap. Shit's ma it's made also the copywriter a little edgy. You're skipping it, Jazz. Be careful. Yeah, well, if he would open his eyes, maybe he'd have a little better time finding it. If he would pay attention to signage and whatnot. And that's it for that. Another high score, just hundreds of points below our last one. Wow. That's what it comes down to, I guess, though. Yay me, and yay high scores. Well, that's it for Dexstar. That ended up being a lot easier than I thought. Basically, you just got to shoot the sides of the reactor as they flash, but that's what C, and that's going to be the really, really super end, I think. C is supposed to come before C. If, and then we'll do here. No, it'll just disappear entirely. Sorry. I know y'all like watching the snow pile up. Oh, well. Sorry. <laughs> Next time.